In this series, I'll be introducing you to Android development and walk through a number of tutorials that will get you started. This course is ideal for beginners or those who want to learn Android development. I'm going to be following a number of the instructions that are provided in the training section of the Getting Started at developer.android.com. Here you have a number of text-based tutorials that you can read through, but I'll be creating a number of videos that follow these tutorials as well as offer additional instructions. In order to get started, you need to have Android Studio. You can go to the homepage of developer.android.com and then click the link to get Android Studio. Currently, the most recent version is 2.3.3. You can use this and follow along in all the videos that I'm going to be providing, although I'm actually going to be using Android Studio 3. Currently, it's available as a preview. It will be coming out soon, so you can certainly take a look at it and walk through the videos with me. I'll be using Android Studio 3 and I'll update every time there's a new beta. You can download this for Windows or Mac and then follow some instructions on the next screen to help you install it. The reason I'm also using Android Studio 3 is that it has support for Kotlin, which is the newest language that allows you to create apps in Android using a newer programming language. First, though, with the series that I'll be creating, I'll start with learning how to write apps in Java and Android SDK based on these tutorials. And the reason for that is you want to have a good foundation. And then when we learn Kotlin, it'll make a lot more sense. All right, go ahead and get Android Studio installed and be sure to subscribe and catch me in the next video.